Hello YouTube, this is iPhone Pro. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here representing TouchSwipe.com and I've got something really great to show you today. A lot of people aren't aware that you can use touchscreen uh, controls for things like uh, video game emulators. Well, I'm here to show you today that you can using a um, application known as Hot Virtual Keyboard. You can Google that. Uh, the application does cost money, but they do give you a 30-day trial, thank God. Uh, in, in regards to that, we are hoping, um, I have passed the idea on to a developer that I know, and hopefully together we will be making a on-screen uh, virtual controller for the uh, many different emulators that you can find. But for now, this works actually just great. Uh, when you get the hot virtual keyboard, I'm going to pull it up. What you're going to want is to use the UMPC style, as you can see. Um, I'm going to be using the Nintendo 64 emulator, which is very easy to use. And what you're going to want to do, you can't use it full screen because the keyboard keys will not work uh, in conjunction with the full screen. But what you're going to want to do is when you get this, is you're going to go to Options, Configure Plugin, uh, and this is for your controls, and you'll map them to each key here on, on the keyboard. Alright, so let's get started. I really have had a lot of fun with this, and I really can't wait to show you that this is something that's possible, and it's, it's just awesome. Alright, we're going to use Cruising USA, one of my old favorites here for the Nintendo 64. Now I've got the the Z key matched here, which was the bat the bottom like trigger finger. I've got all the. Eh, I'm not going to go through all the keys. You know, you can really map them out pretty much however you want to. So I have the start button here. Start, start, start. I'm just going to hit start. I don't really care what I'm using here. It's just a demo, so just to show you guys what we're doing here, but. Look at this. I mean, I have touch screen controls, and this is really great when I'm when I have the the computer folded into a tablet. It's really awesome. So they're very responsive. I have multi touch. I'm using two fingers at one time, as you can see. I've got one finger on the um, accelerator and the other on the on the steering, and it's working. Now, one of the things that, that kind of sucks about this is the, the keys are really small. So, you really have to be able to pay attention to the screen, but also know where to push on these little buttons, like, you know, without looking at them. So, hopefully, between uh, Jolly Wombat and I, he's the, he's the gentleman who mods at our forum, who I, uh, I brought this up to, and said, hey, you know, why don't we get together and uh, you know with your skills hopefully we can we can put together a on-screen controller for the emulators so if we do we'll have much bigger buttons here for this so you know this is pretty much all I wanted to show you here um, we've got emulators now I've used this with the Super Nintendo which is ZSNES and also with this uh, pro um, Nintendo 64 emulator which is Project 64 it's real easy. You pull up your on-screen keyboard, you map your keys, and you play your games. So that's it. I mean, you got to admit, this is fantastic. This is really a breakthrough for the touchscreen device world, especially if you like to play emulators. Uh, and it does work on other uh, applications as well. And that's pretty much all we have for you today. Uh, I'd like to thank you for your, for your time and watching my videos. I hope you enjoy them. If you like the videos, please subscribe. Uh, if you like this video, please rate it. And uh, also today, since obviously you can see I'm using both my hands, I had the assistance of my lovely wife. And uh, go ahead and say hi, honey. Hi. And uh, I'd like to thank her for helping me today as well. Well, thank you, YouTube. I hope to see you down at touchswipe.com. I'm going to leave the link, of course, over to the right of the video. And uh, I want to wish everybody a great day. Thanks, YouTube. Take it easy.